So today we'll be going over a simple primary care review on preeclampsia with severe features. Preeclampsia with severe features. The diagnosis of preeclampsia with severe features is made in the woman with preeclampsia and the presence of one or more of the following. Systolic blood pressure is greater than or equal to 160 millimeters of mercury or diastolic blood pressure is greater than or equal to 110 millimeters of mercury on two occasions at least four hours apart. New onset cerebral or visual disturbance, such as a severe headache or photopsia, impaired liver function, thrombocytopenia, where it's less than 100,000 platelets per microliter, Renal insufficiency, serum creatinine is greater than 1.1 milligrams per deciliter or a doubling of the serum creatinine concentration in the absence of another renal disease. Pulmonary edema. Maternal complications. Maternal complications with the onset in the second trimester include HELP syndrome, renal insufficiency, placenta abruption, pulmonary edema, and eclampsia. Fetal complications. Short-term complications include growth restriction and preterm birth. Long-term complications inc include an increased frequency of IQ values that, that were either subnormal or abnormal and was identified. 54% of the children had normal results on all tests of developmental outcome. 7% of the children were attending special education classes. And lastly, there were no blind or deaf children in the cohort. Management. Women with preeclampsia with severe features are usually delivered promptly to prevent maternal and fetal complications. Delivery is always in the best interest of the mother. However, preterm delivery is not always in the best interest of the fetus. Therefore, a decision to delay delivery can be considered under cer certain circumstances. Previable gestational age. Termination of pregnancy is the option to reduce the mother's risk of developing life-threatening morbidity. Pregnancies from viability to 33 plus 6 weeks of gestation. Expectant management is an option. These patients should be hospitalized and cared by a maternal fetal medicine specialist. At greater than or equal to 34 weeks of gestation, delivery is recommended for all women with preeclampsia with severe features. Thank you.